For fast, cheap, and reliable Madden 22 coins, make sure to go to instantmaddencoins.com. Use code MMG for 10% off. Boys! What it do, baby? Hey, it's good to see you guys as always. It's game three of the new season, and you're seeing this video after the divisional round of the playoffs, right? I have not yet seen the divisional round. I'm recording this right before the divisional round of the playoffs. So two things. If there's any players that had upgrades that I've already missed, well, clap my cheeks, because I don't have them. But two, I do want to give my predictions. I gave my predictions for the wild card, and I was incorrect on the Niners beating the Cowboys. That was one hell of a game, though. Really funny game, actually. QB draw when you have 14 seconds on the clock. Galaxy Brain McCarthy. Bengals versus Titans, Niners versus Packers, Bills versus Chiefs. This division round's gonna be sick, dude. Here's my predictions. Joe Shiesty is gonna take down the Titans in an upset. So I got the Bengals. Packers beat the Niners, cause there's just no way the Niners are going that far. If they do, then I slept on them twice and you can clap my cheeks. Uh, Bills Chiefs, I got the Bills. I want a Bills Packers Super Bowl. I think it'd be sick. And I've got the Buccaneers winning as well. Tom Brady's Tom Brady. He knows how to play in the playoffs. We'll see how it goes, boys. But that's not what we're worried about today. So let's pretend your team lost in the playoffs or never made the playoffs. You still have so much to look forward to because in Wheel of Up, we can still make the playoffs. This is our fucking team and our team's going to the playoffs and we're going to get another Super Bowl ring. I'm going to look like Tom Brady at the end of 2022. And for those of you asking for Wheel of 2K, I am going to start it a lot sooner this year. Under Determined when I will start it. I think my trajectory, I'm gonna go Wheel of Mutt, then uh, theme teams. I'm gonna do a theme team for every NFL team. I did it two years ago. I took a year off, now I'm back. And then I'll go into Wheel of 2K. Got a huge dub last game, which locked Tebow and Shaq Thompson into our team. We needed that so badly, like seriously, so badly. We needed Tebow on this team. He's gonna be the catalyst of many, many more wins. That is what I believe. Darren Waller, Jerry Rice, Debo Samuel, DK Metcalf. So Debo didn't get him any touchdowns last game, but literally no touchdowns were scored last game because we played played the reincarnation of Adolf Hitler. That guy sucked so bad. Oh my God. We're one and one. Terrible offensive line. No fullback. No wide receiver depth or really good wide receivers other than DK. No defensive line. Mediocre corner three. And um, we have a half incredible linebackers and half uh, homeless people. Let's figure it out today, boys. Booga booga. Make Will a mutt. <laughs> Come on, baby! I want a D-London! Out of position, jackpot. What are my options? Cordero Patterson, although he's a corner, I don't really need that right now. There's also Megatron free safety, but that's also like, like, I don't need that. Did we finally replace Darren Waller? There's a Michael Vick halfback. There's a Robert Woods tight end. The time has finally come. It's the right play. I don't have a backup tight end. I got shit back there. He's got 93 speed. So I'm going to put him at tight end two, and then I'm also going to put him at slot wide receiver. I still don't feel better about Taysom Hill than Darren Waller. Darren Waller is a true tight end. He's bigger than Taysom Hill, better at blocking. I'm like obscenely biased towards this Darren Waller, but Darren Waller is just already so good. So previously I had Debo as my slot wide receiver, now it's gonna be Taysom Hill. It's, just, it's really not the wheel spin I wanted, but I really did need a backup tight end. I'm glad to have Taysom Hill. He's a stud. And we're just gonna have to get creative in getting Debo touchdowns. It was very difficult for me to get Devontae Adams touchdowns as the wide receiver too. That was the problem I was having. Basically, like where he was lined up on the field was giving me trouble. Hey, we got Taysom Hill now. Also my slot wide receiver. It doesn't look like a big upgrade, but I think it is gonna be. I'm not unstarting Darren Waller. He's been too good. Our first wheel spin, unorthodox. This one's gotta get me a defensive player now or an offensive lineman because I, I don't I don't know how good. 92 jackpot could be good. Series Redux jackpot, even better. Series Redux jackpot. There's got to be an elite left or right end sitting in Series Redux. In fact, off the top of my dome, I'm pretty sure Montez Sweat is a Series Redux. I think I've had him on this team like twice now though. So let's go program Series Redux. Number one, I want to see what's the highest overall in the Redux promo right now. 94. I already see Willie McGinnis. JJ Watt is most likely the move. Oh, Nick Bosa. Racism o'clock. Oh, and there's a Miles Garrett too. Oh, there's a lot of studs. This Anthony Barr has to be insane, right? Oh my god. Holy shit. I'm going Anthony Barr. I would like Nick Bosa, but that Nick Bosa only had 95 speed, and usually when I'm looking at these, you know, DNs, I want somebody that can contain, like, Derrick Henry. So I kind of want the Montez Sweats of the world. Anthony Barr. 94 overall. Tall as shit, and he's got 91 speed. Should be able to give him Enforcer for 2 AP. You know, that's actually my highest overall linebacker. He's actually technically my best linebacker, although I still think, I think Devin White's superior. The only remaining Bummy linebacker is Buddy Johnson. Somebody needs to make a movie out of uh, Buddy Johnson. Goes up through high school. He's slept on. Coaches don't believe in him. He gets benched. The starter goes down. Oh, fuck. We have to put Buddy Johnson in. Buddy Johnson goes in there. National championship. Whole high school. Whole high school wants him. Pick Buddy Johnson. The school goes crazy. He fucks his crush right in her ass. Bruh. Woo! 
<laughs> Buddy Johnson, the movie. Buddy Johnson 2, the sequel. Buddy Johnson 3, the return of Shrek. Buddy Johnson 4, the Matrix edition. Buddy Johnson, uh, you gotta come out with like a merch line. You gotta come out with collectibles. Kids will have little bobbleheads of Buddy. Buddy Johnson! And the challenge wheel, it was clutch in game one. It was very clutch in game one. Let's see if we can do something similar in game three. Our challenge wheel is two bronze touchdowns. Well, the good news is, a lot of bronze is on this team, so it can very well be done. I'm thinking Jacob Johnson off the top of my head. No, I think it'd have to be Jacob Johnson, actually. That is, yeah, because I got some depth. I have Debo and Jerry Rice at wide receiver, so it's gonna have to be Jacob Johnson, my fullback. Another Derrick Henry, bro. Another Derrick Henry. Ah! Uh, you know, the rest of his team didn't look too spectacular. He had that Metcalf in his top three, so I think that's good news. First and ten, run right side. Yeah. Oh, what? I didn't light him up with Devin White? Come on. Throw something stupid. Throw something stupid early. Let's get you on tilt. Let's see if he tries it again. I'll just lurk the fuck. Oh, he tried it, bro. First and ten. Come on. You know you want to throw something stupid. You know you want to make a mistake. Ah! That's close. If this is a run, I'm in trouble. Oh, it was Wildcat. I should have known who's running right out the gates. Divine Diablo already with three tackles. Third and six? You're not running it, are you? Dude, what's with these guys running chew clock in the first quarter? You just gotta delay a game. Third and 11. I have a QB spy on him. Got some underneaths covered. I've got some over the tops covered. He wants to go halfback. He wants to go halfback. Come on! What the fuck? How many times is this gonna happen? It happened last game too. Oh my god. I am right you know what? Don't give me the pick. It's fine. Don't give me the interception. But don't give him the fucking completion. Hey, is that Quentin Bohana? That was Marquis Spencer. That was a great play by him, for real. I think he wants to throw a check down, and I'm going to pick it off the nickel Roby fucking Coleman. Okay. Step up, boys. Step up, Shaq Thompson. Big hit. Derrick Henry does not fumble. We got ourselves a fourth and three. If he scrambles, I might be in trouble. Um, I really don't know how we completed that. The clock isn't even running, and you're letting it run down just to snap it. What are we doing? That's what we're fucking doing. We're Derrick Henry. We're Derrick Henry. Oh, I wanted to swerve the shit out of him, but he didn't click on. Let's go! God! User lurk, Shanti. Ooh. The underneath is there. There honestly might have been something deep. I was a little too skittish to throw it, though. I think I think DK Metcalf might have been. And I think I'm going to choose Debo Samuel. Oh, Etienne. Don't tell me Travis fucking Etienne just torched. Oh, my God. What a ball from Debo on the run. I'm going to start out with a Debo. Let's just lock in Debo and upgrade. Once I have that lead and the ball I have, I'll feel pretty good. And you know what? If this game keeps going, maybe I get Debo touchdowns and Jacob Johnson. I love this motion slant over the middle. Oh, he sees it. He sees it. Oh, he's there. Oh, my God. Debo. What a play! He stepped up his linebacker. We didn't cross the line of scrimmage. And Debo's got a touchdown. Yes, sir! First and 10, play action for sure. Rolling left. And he's going to step up and have a lot of room to work with. I don't think he expects a blitz, so I'm going to send it. Oh. Oh, shit. shit. Boy. I thought that was actually a run. It is a play action. He's going to throw under, I think. Oh! What a play! Huge play from Tupelolu! Holy shit, what a stud! He really picked that up, huh? Uh-oh, the halfback is kind of, sort of open. Oh, that's the last thing I saw. Straight up. Ah, it's just got a fucking offsides. How I got offsides, I really don't know. Holy fucking crack bag, you see that block? God, this is stupider than shit, dude. Oh, wait, you know what I could do? I was just about to say I could have ran that clock out. How the fuck did I get it off sides? On what? Oh, nice bailout, dude. Now you're going to get a touchdown here, huh? That is just... That is just great. Oh, great step up! Derrick Henry goes down. All right, he'll throw underneath. He'll probably go out of bounds. He looked like a field goal type of guy. Well, I get ball half. One touchdown here. Put this puppy away. Hey, Shentoon, thank you, my guy. I appreciate it. I'm waiting for a message from this guy, presumably, because he just paused in the middle of the game. There's press coverage on Taysom Hill. Do you think Taysom Hill could take his man? He actually could. Metcalf. Fuck! I couldn't get the pass off because my offensive line is a bunch of bums. That was a touchdown. Ow! That hurts. And he's not there this time. But RB actually uh. kind of is? No. 
But there goes Darren Waller. He's gonna catch it, but not for a first. And, and I'm not even close to a first action. I think Waller should get there. Oh, Jesus. Torched him. Absolutely torched Palomar. Let's see where he goes. He's on Winfield. Oh, shit. I think Waller's open after, like, waiting two seconds here. <laughs> oh, shit. I threw it to the outside on accident. He was wide open. I'm gonna bring Waller over to hopefully distract him. I want him to take the Waller slant. Oh, you gotta love that he gets just instant fucking pressure. Oh, pick it. Pick it. Yes. Punt. He just got instant screaming pressure off the right side. I could have thrown RB, but didn't see it till a little late. Looks like I'm on Buddy Johnson now. Not really what I want. Throw it. I know what you're looking at. Throw it. <sighs> Nightmare, dude. It's kind of what I get. I didn't get a. I didn't get an end who can guard him. Ooh, that's open. Yes! Yes! Finally! Let's go! After all those big hits, we get rewarded. Yes, dude, we were rocking them. And that is why we keep Enforcer on. I love to see it. Metcalf deep. Hey, stop. That's good. You think, okay, so his user should be covering Metcalf deep, but you think if he, if he thinks about that for a little bit too long, I think, wow, how, 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 how are you mossing me in single coverage? How, dude? I need to know. Fuck. They let you buy wins. You actually can just buy a fucking win. And this is the perfect example. Oh, He has a check down. Oh, oh, oh. How's that shit, my cat? Let's go. Let's go. Stop and go. Yup. One, two, three. On your feet. We're so close. So close. Whoa. This turned into a defensive game? How did that happen? Holy shit. Defense keeping my abysmal offense alive. And you know what? At this point, I'm tempted to run the ball. Because going to the air, I have been making some questionable decisions. Let's run an inside zone. Look at those blocks, though. Hey. Hey. It's not. Tebow. Come on, Tebow. Oh my god, the amount of fucking times I hit his Derrick Henry for me to fumble right there. Fumble six right there. The amount of times I hit him, bro. Dude, congrats. You're fucking horrible. Nope, you're not fast enough. Oh, I'm sure that was so hard for him. Dude, like what? What the fuck was that? Oh my god, we didn't even run the play right. This is a joke. Fourth and eight, it's the two minute warning. I'm looking to the right side here. See how he sets up on Waller. There's Hill. Huge catch. What do you mean? What do you mean? This guy's gonna win off of a fumble six. Don't worry, he won't fumble. And I'm on the wrong dude, now I'm in real trouble. I cannot wait to watch the highlight. Oh, I can't wait to watch the highlight, dude. Fourteen, seventeen. I almost think I onside kick no matter what, just in case I get it. And then we stop him three times, hopefully. Oh. Who are you going to throw to? <laughs> it wasn't even a good ball right there. If it was a good ball, I'd fucking pick it off. Oh, you got to love that. I'm going to have an aneurysm, I think. I hate that he is running in the open field with his quarterback. I fumble sixth when I did that. That'll go on the top five most frustrating. And I didn't complete my challenge. I'm gonna lose my players. No Anthony Barr. And who else did I lose? Taste Mel? I guess that's not the end of the world, dude. I can't wait to watch this back. Oh, that's smart, EA. Fourth and eight for eight yards. It is very smart to not show me his replay. So I'm gonna freak the fuck out if I saw that. Here's the thing. So on third and 18, right? I threw that exact same pass. I put a streak on my tight end and a slant on Taysom Hill. So the first time I threw it, it went for 10 yards. Possession catch, same spot of the field. Second time I throw it, it only goes for eight, but it's fourth and eight. So I guess it must've been fourth and 8.5 and I got 8.4. I was on that shit. This is the ball that I perfectly lurked and it just somehow gets completed by him. What? I'm right with it and I jump like a fucking idiot. Look at this. Couldn't be in better position. Yeah, we'll call that two feet in bounds. This is the NFL, right? Where you need two feet in bounds? Uh, yeah, we'll call that two. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't 
don't know about that one, Chief. So there's the left foot. So when does the right foot come down for this conversion? Because he converted this. Now, I don't remember. I was saying not only did I pick me. So when does that foot come down? So it hasn't touched the grass yet. <laughs> It looks like it was made by a tree. It's not even like there's a ref out there to fuck it up. This is a computer game. This is, there's an electronic system that determined his foot is in bounds. How did it determine that? What a great game to complete my challenge. Cause I could have salvaged, you know, Anthony Barr. We do get one Evo Samuel upgrade. You know, if anything, it inspires me. It inspires me to upgrade this team, get wins and get my ass in the Super Bowl. On the bright side, Tony Fields, the 69th can come back in. Anthony Barr is out. Uh, D-Line, you know what? You guys honestly played good for what you were dealing with. That's really, really difficult difficult to stop and they tried their best. Losing Taysom Hill isn't the end of the world. The redemption tour continues, boys. I'm gonna need a dub next game and I will just keep cranking on Debo Samuel. We'll come back better and stronger than ever in the next game. One and two right now though. All right, I love you boys. I'll see you in the next episode. Thanks for watching as always. Peace.